Good morning. Welcome back to the channel. G2 Draft Time. Spring, no, winter, early 2023 draft. If you don't know how it works, stick around. I'm going to let you know. Whew. The draft, our biggest one yet. 42, 43 units. 38 tickets available. Half on the nation, half on the Patreon page. Lottery style. Let's say how the draft works. Well, first, how you get the tickets. Tickets are $105 USA, $115 if you are international. That covers your shipping, your PayPal fees, and your yo-yo that you pick in the draft. So everything's all included in that price. Um, on Friday morning, I will make a post for Patreon and on the Facebook page in the Facebook official G2 Nation Facebook group. And you can just say, hey, I'm interested. I'd like to enter. I'll have some some kind of question that opts you in on that post. Um, then I, that night, Friday night, I will do a um, drawing to see who gets the tickets. Um, if you get a ticket, you got to come back Tuesday. Well, you don't have to, but it's preferred if you come back Tuesday evening, 9 p.m. Eastern YouTube live stream to pick your yo-yo. I encourage you to come even if you don't get a ticket. It's fun. Come hang out. Um, so if you get a ticket, I'll give you your tracking. That shipping label is going to be your lottery ticket for where you're drawing for the draft. The draft, Tuesday, 9 p.m. Eastern. What happens here is I have everybody's shipping labels in a bucket. Pull out the shipping label. Your name gets called. You pick from what is available. So um, obviously it's better to get your name called first, but that's part of the fun, kind of like a sports draft. Um, your name's called, you pick your yo-yo, that yo-yo's off the board, it's coming to your house. Next person's called, they can get anything else, minus the yo-yos that have been picked in front of them. Um, there is less tickets than yo-yos, so you're still gonna get something outside of like your bottom five, no matter what. Um, price is the same across the board, many different options and values, blah, blah, blah. Your ticket covers your yo-yo, your shipping, everything. Okay, what can my ticket get me? Let's talk about it. All right, get your pens and paper, Excel sheet, whatever you want, ready? I'm gonna rock and roll right on through this list. The first three here, three pack, these are the only glitches in the party. Um, the Sponge AO7 Hawks. Um, these were salvaged from the uh, trash grade bin after some half swapping, after a couple years of uh, sitting in the bin. So we've got three of those glitches, AO7 available. life the blue and um, purple blue and pink acid wash in the splash just uh, a beauty arbiter oh the iridescent rims with the pink to blue fade now retired arbiter mongoose first blood Prototypey action. What do we have here? We've got the Luna V2. Um, if you have the Luna production version, you'll definitely see that this cup is different. They play differently. Um, kind of fun to go through the lineage of uh, prototype compared to the production. If that's not your thing, there's plenty of other options. All of these are basically considered the same in the draft. Your ticket covers any of them that you get to pick. Uh, Banshee SS, the Hulk. Beautiful green with the purple SS rims. We've been holding these extras back for, oh, I don't know, six months now. Another Banshee SS here. AL7 version. This is that um, brown with the brass rims. The hat, heaviest version of the Banshee SS because it's AL7 body as well. Pelican. Oh, okay. Can you see that? the uh, solar splatter solar speckle uh, just awesome on a pelican likely our only pelican in this batch uh, we've got a reaper here i'll get a box for it it's the aqua with the pink splash just beautiful a carbine the blue and pink acid wash carbine banshee ss al7 green with gold there we go um yeah Another one, uh, that's the other colorway from the heaviest version. I believe we only did those two colors in the AL7 with brass rims. We've got a Reaper in the Pacific Storm. Just uh, incredible. Love the Pacific Storm. Wouldn't be surprised too much if like a Pacific Storm like this Reaper or Luna snuck into the top for somebody that collects Pacific Storms. 
Pacific Fade Mongoose. Um, we will also have a, have a little contest for the top 10 picks for whoever's interested. Um, if you get them all right, we'll have something to give away. Another prototype here. This is for the Agent 001 before we named it the Pilgrim. Um, some changes were made to this before the final version. So kind of in that Luna category that it's fun to play back to back and see if you can tell what adjustments were made. Arbiter, retired now. Silver body, black. SS rims, just clean. One of my favorite overall for like solid colors. We've got a Luna production, Cherry Bomb. I mean, I was just talking about my favorite solids, but Cherry Bomb is fantastic. Valhalla Berry Storm. Another Reaper here in the Interstellar. That's got to be in the top five, right? Not a lot of those out there. Triton Prototype. Rainbow. Um, okay, so we probably undercovered the number one draft pick. I assume for most. Prototype, uh, Rainbow, Titanium Triton. Production version should be here any day now. We can know. Peach Banshee 22. If you missed the drop, more uh, Banshee 22 is not probably coming for the next few weeks at least. Just kind of depends on the energizer. Um, Valhalla 117 Brass Rim. Green with gold. AL7 Carbine Pacific Storm. Just a beaut. Great player. Um, so the AL7 Carbine was the first of the redesign for AL7 version that we adjusted the CAD just a tad. Um, so it's only about a gram heavier than the other, the regular version. Um, anyways, yes, the AL7. Now we got a Blackout Valhalla. Ooh, Aquamarine Valhalla. Banshee SS. Okay. Another of those Pacific Storms. This one's kind of special. It has the blue SS rims to go along with it. Decade. Nebula. Valhalla. Berry Fade. I believe that one's AL7, don't quote me. Another Valhalla here. Okay, yes, I love this one. Um, this was one of the mystery boxes that we did recently, but the orangish brown is incredible with those black rims right there. Probably should take pictures of that one for the G2 drop page just to have it on record at this point. Okay, more epicness. Luna, Mongoose, Luna, Luna Star. Lu what did I call that? I can't remember. I'm drawing a blank. I apologize. But it's that blue base with the um, yellow to orange to pink faded speckle. Now, the Berry Storm Reaper. Banshee 22. Boom. Deep purple. Valhalla. I love this colorway. It's a, like a light purple lilac wash on brass rims. Mongoose in the gray with black speckle. It's hard to keep saying how much I like the colorways, but that's mostly what I do. Pacific Storm on the Luna. Back to back Lunas. The smoke version. Gray, black, silver rim. Very cohesive and AL7 Banshee SS, incredible. That aqua teal with the purple rims, 10 on 10. Covenant, now retired. Berry Storm. I just said Covenant, now retired. I take that back. Yes, because I have one color left. And I believe I mentioned that during the, I don't know when, but there is one color left hiding out somewhere in my office. Boom, another titanium prototype there on the Trident. Not rainbow this time. Valhalla in the champagne poppin' colorway. But not least, if I can get this box back together. An AL7 carbine, it's gotta be the Hailstorm. Just an incredible colorway here. Look at that, baby. Uh-huh, um, since the AL7 carbines only come in two colors. 
So we already have the Pacific Storm Rover. Those are the options for the draft. It's going to be an incredible time. See you Tuesday for the draft Friday for your ticket.